Hello everyone, this is Juan from Ken Hub and welcome to another anatomy tutorial where this time we're going to be talking about the sacrum and the coccyx. And in order to do so, we're going to be looking at these two images that you see now on the screen. So here on the image on the left side, you can clearly see here the ventral view of the sacrum and also here the coccyx. And on this image of the right side here, you find the dorsal view now of the two bones. So in this tutorial, we're going to be talking about two main points. One is going to be the different bones and bony landmarks that we find here. And another one will be then the most important ligaments that we find attached to the sacrum. As you can clearly see here on these two images, the sacrum is triangular in shape and is made up of five initially infused bones that will fuse between the ages of 30 and 40. Superiorly, the sacrum will be articulating with the last lumbar vertebra, L5, and inferiorly, it will articulate with this bone that we're going to be talking about on this tutorial as well, the coccyx. First structures we're going to be highlighting here on these two images are the wings of the sacrum. You can clearly see why we call them wings. They do spread on both sides of the bone and look like two wings. These are then the structures that will be supporting the psoas major muscle and also the lumbosacral trunk. We also have here some important structures. As you can see, these holes that we're going to be talking about on the next slide these are known as then the sacral foramina and they're highlighted here in green. On the sacrum, you're going to be finding four pairs of sacral foramina. We can see here three clearly highlighted, but notice here there are two other foramina that you find a bit above. Now on the anterior aspect, the foramina will be transmitting the ventral primary rami of the sacral nerves and on the posterior aspect, the dorsal primary rami. So important structures will be passing through the sacral foramina. And here on this image, you can now see them from a posterior view and you can now clearly see here the four pairs highlighted on both sides of the sacrum. The next structure, the next landmark that we're going to be highlighting here on our bone, the sacrum, is then the base of the sacrum. This video is not over yet. Continue watching now the full video at kenhub.com. We have lots more videos like this one available to our premium members on our website, not to mention all the fun quizzes, related articles, and atlas sections. So click on the button in the middle to watch the full-length video and master anatomy.